Hi my friend, this is William. In this video I'm going to show how to use the desktop DDR2, DDR3 RAM slot LED tester to test the uh, motherboard uh, DDR RAM slot connectors. Um, first of all, I would like to introduce the features on this card first. This is a combo card. It has both DDR2 and DDR3 one side for DDR2 and one side for DDR3 and this is for testing desktop computers RAM slot connectors here we see a uh, switch buttons to power on and off okay and a battery socket for a bottom like uh, bottom shape battery CR2032 okay um, before we get started to use this card we need to use a um, eraser to clean the test pin first for better contacts and also can help to get rid of the oxidation as well okay don't press the card too hard in the in the middle otherwise we'll bend the card okay Okay, I believe this is pretty much good enough. Alright, next what we need to do is take the bottom battery, install. Okay, here we have the spring, a uh, little small uh, spring over here, the locker, battery locker. We need to install the battery, the plus sign facing up. Okay, here we have plus sign facing up. We installed it one end to here first, okay, and then push on the spring side. This will help to lock the battery securely and not to break the battery socket, okay. And now we are ready to install this onto the computer to test the RAM slot. All right, now let's take the cover case. Alright, before we install this desktop DDR2 and DDR3 RAM slot connectors to test the desktop computer RAM slot, we need to discharge the desktop computer first. Okay, we have a uh, small, a, we need to press the uh, computer's power button first. Okay, over here. the top of the okay hold it we need to remove the power cord pressing the bottom over 20 seconds this will discharge the whole systems remaining statics all right and probably just need to wait 20 seconds and of course we can press a couple times on the power buttons then next to do is install the RAM slot testers to the RAM, RAM slot. Okay, this is DDR2. Okay, make sure it is right. All right, for testing Intel main board, we don't need to have the CPUs on the motherboard. For testing AMD motherboard, we need to have, we must have the AMD CPUs installed on the motherboard. Okay, now we just need to secure it, push the card and secure it. Right, and then press the power on buttons. It's over here. Push that. Oh, okay, we can see a lot of lights are on. Okay, and then we can do this testing. Referring to the menu to, to see which RAM address line is not working or, or short circuit. And just follow the menus there. Okay, and hope this video helps you to um, to know how to install the RAM and some precautions. Again, before installing the card, please make sure we discharge the motherboard by removing the power cord and pressing the um, power button over 20 seconds. Okay, and then install the card and press the switch button on the card. All right, hope this helps.
Any question, please let me know. Mm -hmm. This way I'm there. Okay, see you later.